Should we avoid toxic people? Hey guys, how are you doing? Hope you're doing well. Jumping on to do a little uh, chat on um, avoiding toxic people. Um, so is there really any toxic people? Well, it depends on your view. I know a lot of people may uh, struggle with that because when we're on the receiving end um, or being in the environment or the experience of having toxic people around us, it can very much depend on where we are in that moment. That expression of sharing in that experience with people around who are creating that situation. Right? And although they're creating it, we're a part of it. And so we are in the awareness of it, allowing that to happen to help us to see it and view it from that point of view, which is the creation of itself from that point of view and the awareness that you are where you are. So with that being said, the experience that we create is the awareness of it. So we can be it. And then from that, we're expressing uh, where we are to be of something else which is the wanting of something else, to create something else somewhere else uh, and not be where we are, right? And so the expression of it is the awareness of itself creating beyond our illusion of the human form and the experience of where we are, its deepest level of awareness that it can be, right? And so that's the changing of the timeline. It's creating something else. I'm aware of I'm in this place, in this environment with toxic people that I don't want to be in this, <laughs> doing this. And so what am I doing? I'm creating something else because I don't want to be here. Or because of the situation, you're creating other things that's creating opportunities for other things to evolve and happen. This is not where I want to be, so I want to be there. So creating something else on a timeline. Right? And so to share an experience of where you are is not always that they're toxic people because those people are the ones that we agree to come into alignment with to have that experience and share in it with them, right? Because we have this all agreements, right? They have their journey. They needed to work something out. We have our journey. We needed to work something out. And so together we come together to share in the experience of it and creating of it. And so we can look at it as they are toxic people, or we can look at it and enjoy the journey by knowing that they are the love expression of themselves and who you are to help you to move out of your experience and where you are on the timeline to be somewhere else. It's the creation of together, all coming together, collaborating as one and whole in the divine expression of love for the right reasons and the right purpose. But we have the streams of consciousness and we can look at it as they're toxic people they're the ones hurting me we can blame and shame and hate and everything else or we can take the other side of the stream of conscious which we're creating from that point and we can jump timelines to it and to see it from that perspective that they're there for me to get me out of the void of being where i don't want to be so i can be where i want to be which is love and the next best thing the higher consciousness of something else that i want right because what that toxic environment brings to you is something else that you want to be of that's better, right? So it's always the next better thing um, on the timeline, which is expression of itself where you are that can see all things from its living, living it out, right? And so when you're living it out, it's the timeline of where you are. That's bringing it about its awareness so you can be and see and have something else, right? And so that coming together, choreographed together, whether they are want to be related but to you by the toxic people, it gives you the self, right? The ability to be in the state of higher conscious and choosing to see it from a different perspective, which is your higher self, love, source, opportunity for you to be the, not the better, or but your best self. So you can see from the opposite streams of consciousness. Thank you for helping me to see where I was so I can be somewhere else and create something else that I want to be of so I'm not there anymore. So thank you for being that for me and showing up for me in the name of love, which is the creation of itself in another way, another form, another being, another experience, right? That's going to be creating from its place, right? And so it's almost like a ladder, if you will, the creation of one thing to create of another, to create of another, to create of another. 
which is experience that you get to experience all things in it, which is the realization of it where you are from the expression and experiencing of it. That's creating something new and more, right? That's evolution. That's evo evolving through the timelines of evolution, the creation of all things as it is where it is based on who it is or where you are or who you think you are <laughs> at that moment. But it's experience. It's not who you are. It's not really true. It's just the experience that's showing up as true for you because that's where you believe that you are in that in that place, right? Instead of in the name of love, but it's all in the name of love because they're helping you, right? Put it all together. Um, and it's this give and take of the universe and seeing what's going on that will help you to evolve further and more along the timeline um, of being in your existence to where you are. That's creating from itself, right? Um, now, the timelines of existence um, are there for you. And again, it's from one to the other, different streams, which is all one in each of it, uh, from one end to the other. Um, not really duality, but you can call it a reference to duality, but beyond here is not considered duality. It's called, called duality here, but it's the existence of being, which is one in all things, right? The experience of one thing, because you can't experience the same thing over and over again, but you can only experience one thing at one time, which is the being of it, which is creating up something else to be where you want to be somewhere else um, on the timeline. So your toxic friends, your environment is helping you to be your best version of yourself to say, hey, thank you from a space of love. Thank you for helping me to be where I want to be, not where I don't want to be. And so it is the expression of love that you're being at all times that you're not that what you're seeing it from, because those are two different streams of consciousness, right? Because we um, may not be seeing from that timeline because of the experience. So it's the expression of love that you're being at all times. Um, it is seeing from it that's not, right? Which is our awareness on the timeline. But we're always love. Beyond the timeline, we're always love. And everything is made in, in love for the purpose of you in, in evolving. So it's all there for you. It's never, never against you. right? But we believe it is because we're within the experience, which is the illusion. right? So whether that's your false truth, because the truth shows up as your truth, even in the illusion. So it's a false truth. right? And so it's the expression of love no matter where you are that's being. So choose love in all of your experiences. To see from it from that point of view thank you for the experience i love you hopefully that makes sense happy journeys